Hi, YouTube. This is Sexy Hair Fetish, and I'm here to let you guys know what my freaking vlog is going to be about. Number one. This is probably my second intro, but it's going to be my intro because the first intro didn't go so well. So, I'm going to do this one because the other one, I didn't know what the hell I was doing. And stuff didn't work the way I wanted it to work, and it's just a lot going on. But... This is going to be a vlog about vlog, video vlog, whatever, about hair, 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 dance, makeup, makeup, dance, and pretty much anything creative, and I'll probably share some of my thoughts on certain things or whatever, but for the most part, it's going to be centered around creativity, because I love creativity. My homie, Lala, started her fashion line it's called Popcorn Label. Look it up. It's www.popcornlabelinc.com. I'll put it on the sidebar. But, um, uh, sidebar. But anyway, um, yeah, she started her own fashion label, and it's going very well. Very, I'm very proud of her. She came a long way. So some of the stuff that I'll be doing in my vlog, the vlog, is going to be around that also because I am the choreographer for that and I am a very supportive friend. Support. Anyway, um so my hair right now. I've been natural one year, one whole year. July seventh made a year. So a year and a couple of weeks. And it's the best decision I've ever made in my life. Well, one of them. But I love being natural. It is like, it's high maintenance, but then it's low maintenance. I don't have to worry about getting a perm every so often. Um, and then sometimes I could just wash and go. And then shake it out, and I'll just rock some nasty or some curls or whatever. So, that's pretty much what I'll do. And I'll moisturize, of course, and things like that. But I love being natural. And for those who are considering going natural, please, please do it. I'm serious. No, but it's, it's your choice. I'm not going to convert the world to be that. No. But I do, you know, I love it. And the people that I have surrounded me, surrounded, the ones that are surrounded by me, you know what I'm saying, my friends are the ones that are natural and they love it as well and they have no complaints but it's not for everybody at the same time I can't guarantee that you'll love it but you just, it's something that you really have to be ready for and I love it I'm telling you oh my god it's like a whole new love for yourself that you didn't even know this thing it's like you could love yourself in all kinds of ways. But then, like, when you go natural, it's like, it opens up a whole nother can of love. It's weird. It's crazy, but how many times am I going to say love in this video? I love it. But anyway, um, like I said, I've been natural for a year. Um, I'm rocking these braids. This is my protective style for right now. Um, I've been recommended a couple of products that I've tried out. Um, it's been a long learning process this whole year. And, um, I don't know. It's, so far, I feel like I haven't found everything that I need. Like, as far as deep conditioners, I don't know really what to use. If anybody could, you know, steer me in the right direction, something that's a little bit more natural than a regular product or whatever that's working for your hair. My, my hair type is 4A. But anything that's working for your hair, please let me know because I'm just really a little bit lost and as to how my hair should feel. And it's been a couple of times where my hair felt really nice, but it hasn't felt like that in a while. So I don't know if I should use a clarifying shampoo or what. But this, um, so right now I don't have a, 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 a staple deep conditioner, but I know uh, as far as my moisturizers, freaking, um, what's name it, S-Curl, that's my stuff, I love that, I love S-Curl, like S-Curl gel and S-Curl, um, uh, spray, couple that together, spray it on first, do that, and then put the gel in it, beautiful combination, and it'll be moisturized all day, and it won't have that nasty, greasy thing, you know? Also, something else that I love that's also a staple for me is coconut oil. And I don't mean the coconut oil that you 
buy at the store, like a regular beauty supply store. I'm talking about the coconut oil that you buy at a whole food store. Virgin coconut oil or extra virgin coconut oil or whatever they, they want to call it. But it's still virgin. Make sure it's virgin. I love it. It is like, it's a different type of oil because it's moisturizing. You know, like, I don't recommend use it by itself, but it's good, like, for example, if you look it up, it's really good to put it in your hair before you wash your hair, and it'll just moisturize it and, and you know, um, make it feel good and, and moisture you up. But it'll moisturize it, and when you wash it with the harsh um, shampoo that contains sulfate or whatever, I'm trying to stay away from that, but when you wash it, it'll be less stripping of its natural oils, of your scalp natural oils. It'll have more moisture to it. I mean, your hair will definitely thank you if you use some coconut oil. I love coconut oil. What else? Let's see what else do I use. Shea butter. I love shea butter when I'm using, when I'm doing kinky twists. Well, twisting my hair, not the extension twists, but like my real hair, using shea butter feels like heaven, like it's so light, you can't, you don't use a lot, like a little bit goes a long way, like I use it on each strand, I may comb it out, first I put a leave-in conditioner, then I'll put the shea butter on top of it, then I'll twist it up, and my, like the end result is so nice, my hair will be like really light, and it'll feel so healthy and flowy and whatnot, but so far those are the three main things that I say that work with my natural hair. Everything else is like, I'm still learning. I'm gonna, oh, conditioner washes. My hair loves conditioner washes, but I know if I can't do it too, too much, because then that's when it starts to break more. I have to like, you know, build some of that strength in, and that's where that some of the protein comes in. I can't use a straight up protein conditioner, but you know, a moisturizing protein conditioner. So, um, that's pretty much it. I don't know if I said it, my hair goal is down here by December 31st, uh, which is our pit length, and I hope you guys enjoy my videos, and I'm a cool person, silly, and all of that, whatever you want to describe me as, but I'm, I'm a real cool person, so if you have any questions about me being natural, if you're unsure, just hit me up, let me know, I will gladly, gladly answer your 